Good morning, morning guys. We Good don't morning. have a bird. We don't have a bird. We do we have, have a bird. bird. We don't have a bird. We do have a bird. Good morning guys. We have been super busy the last few days. I have rearranged our living room. I'll show you guys in a second. Um, but we ended up making this little thing for Levi. So we're gonna keep um, working on this, but this is his tree that he plays in um, all the time. And we have tied like we a lot of things. We beads on here, but then he broke the thing. Yeah, he breaks everything. And then the beads all fell. Yeah, and this used to be like a more full tree and he's chewed it all, but that's what it's for. It's all for him to chew. Um, but It's we've, fake, it's fake. Yeah, guys. so I'm gonna be working on this as time goes on. I want this to be like his perch. Like I'm gonna put a big perch across here with the help of Sam. Sam, you're helping me. Um, Just eat, that's so easy. Stick a stick here. Yeah, and I have lots of sticks. Make it as wide as here. Yeah. And then like, it'll just stay on. Yeah, like so good for him. And then it's go, see, look at him, he's already playing. He's got his basket here. Like look at his little ball. Like this was a ball not that long ago. And now it's his, his. <laughs> Enemy. Yeah, this is his basket full of toys. We're gonna make it better and better. Um, oh, and watch this. He actually goes up here. Yeah, he actually walks across that. It makes me nervous. <laughs> but it keeps him busy, guys. This is what this is all about. This is keeping him busy, especially when we're busy. I love it, and I love him. He is a crazy bird. Watch. Daredevil. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> when the cat comes, Levi, like, when Levi was on the ground, my mom was in the basement, and the cat came up, and Levi charged the cat, and the cat's like, ah! <laughs> yeah, everybody. The cat's a chicken. Yeah, Levi's a young bird, so he's an active bird, and he is pretty active. Okay, don't scare him. But anyway, this is Levi's brand new area that I'm working on. It's gonna be oh, a work in progress. Um, and this is our living room. I decided to change it over because I love being able to see out the window. And most importantly, I want to put the Christmas tree here. So I want the Christmas tree to be here in the middle of the window. And so I changed it over. The girls and I changed it over yesterday. Sam came home and said, what happened to the living room? It's not perfect. I don't love it. There are a few things that I don't love about it. What are you eating over here? Dad's underwear. <laughs> I was folding laundry there. Um, our furniture is a bit big for this room and um, I don't really like how big it is. So we went furniture shopping last night and we didn't find anything that we liked. I forgot how being an indecisive person translates into all aspects of life. It makes it even hard to find new furniture. You guys know how birds are super sensitive to all the pollution in the air in your home. Like you can't use certain cleaners, you can't use um, a certain baking pans, especially Teflon, stuff like that because they're so sensitive. Um, it's really been making me think about the quality of our air in our home. And the fact that we're going into winter and winter is like a big trigger for Sophie and Sam. They're always sick. And Sophie in the past has had like a lot of problems with her lungs and stuff. So I've been really thinking a lot about air purification. I want this sweet boy to always be healthy, always be safe. Right, Levi? Step up. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So uh, we got ourselves um, this Levoit air purification system. It's the LV131. And I'm so excited to break this, this big baby out of the box. You wanna yeah. open it? Yeah, go ahead, open it. Um, I think this will just make all of us healthier and happier. Can it's gonna remove so many impurities out of our air. We actually got it from Amazon. What even is it? It's an air purification system. It's gonna take all the dust, pollen, smoke, smells, mold, spores, and even pet dander out of our air. Right, this it's gonna make you healthier. Make your environment healthier. So we got this Lavoit True HEPA Air Purification System. It's the LVPUR131 model. And I'm super excited because this thing is supposed to remove 99.97% of dust, pollen, smoke, odor, mold, spores, and even pet dander, get off my chair, out of our air, and I'm excited. So we ended up getting this one, the girls are opening it. We ended up getting this size because it's supposed to cover an average to large room or like about 322 square feet. 
It has a three-stage filtration system. And it even has a sleep mode so that it's really quiet during the nighttime. So you can put it in your bedroom, you can put it in your kitchen, you can put it wherever you guys spend the most amount of room. But yeah, this one actually is, I know you can get smaller ones that, that cover a smaller area. Gabby is our resident builder when Sam's at work. It is super sleek and beautiful. I love it. This piece of plastic right here. All right, you can take the plastic off. No, there's... I think we could probably fit this in a corner somewhere. It's uh, beautiful. All right, let's go plug it in. And just like that, we have cleaner air. I love it. We, I know that where we live, um, any new construction buildings have to have air purification systems built in. But when you have an older home, um, uh, your, your choices are limited. So this is perfect. It's the perfect size. It's not super noisy and it does the job. And now I feel better that the kids and our pets are better protected. Um, if you guys are interested or in the market for a Lavoy air purification system, then I'll leave the Amazon link so that you guys can get your own because um, I know a lot of you guys have pets just like we do. Even a lot of you guys even have birds. So definitely beneficial. We are headed to the barn. Um, we made plans to meet um, Harlow and her owner um, tomorrow to go riding with them to go on a trail ride and uh, she Harlow is having problems with her feet it seems like since it's been fall every single horse is at a commission or having so many problems comment below if you guys are having if any of you guys are having um, lameness issues with your horse or any kind of illness or issue with your horse um, since the fall started Anyway, um, I wanted to tell you guys that Sam went to the doctor today, had an injection in his knee, just exactly like Stella, and he came home and he's like, oh, now they told me I have to do all this exercise. Hmm, just like Stella. So, are you gonna do it? Terrible. So, I wanna challenge Sam to get really active this I fall. I have to walk, though, I have to like, stretch. Oh, it's just stretching, that's all you have to do? And poor Stella has to like, <laughs> <laughs> run her butt off. Anyway, I want to challenge all of you guys um, and myself and my family. Uh, let's make this fall the fall and the winter season that we all get super active, super busy, and stay fit. It's so cold. Like, so cold. The girls are like, I'm putting on another coat. So yeah, this happened today. Uh, Gabby and Sophie dyed their hair to match their saddle pad, but unfortunately they needed more than one package because their hair was so long and right. Sophie's is so thick. So kind of got like a streak effect going on, but they're happy. I love to watch this. So what happens every time Gabby goes into the field, Star waits until she gets, oh, see, he's like, there she is. There's my girl, and then he'll go to her. See? Oh, yep. Straight to her. I love that. Oh, I'm so cold. Like, I had to take my mitt off so I could control the camera. I'm actually wearing gloves, and I'm still cold. And I'm also walking through poop. Let's see, she comes to us now. She's moving forward. We have forward movement. Stop, Sophie. Stop. Oh. Look, though. Look. Look, you guys. Whoa. Look, I don't know if she's like trying to cut us off. Good girl. Look at that. Look at you match her blanket perfectly. She matches her horse, you guys. Good girl. You're such a sweet girl today. Oh, you're so fluffy. Yay. Oh, nice girl. I love your hair. Mom, that black horse is scared. So? Dyed her hair to match her horse's blanket. You dyed your horse. <laughs> yeah, it matches perfectly. Door. Surprise, Kaylee's here. <laughs> Oh, he's 
slippery. <laughs> Are you slippery oh, today? God. Okay, he's going bareback. Bareback and red haired. Storm, your your days are over of tricking me, trying to make me feel like you're lame. Blue haired girl is I have purple. A purple haired girl is gonna be lunging before she rides, right? Because that one might have energy today. Yeah, she doesn't look like it, but we're gonna make sure she doesn't. Door. Yeah. <laughs> what happened to your shoulder? My dad pushed me over my horse. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're going to lunge? Yeah. Hey, you're good at making me lose my mind, but I always come around. Make you smile, don't I? He's like, there's the man with all the treats. Aw, see, Storm loves you, Sam. I'm going outside with Gabby to shoot a video. And you're going to get on your pony. She seems tired out. Well, we did tire her out. Yeah, she seemed tired out before we tired her out. Hey, Sophia, move. Just wait, Sophie's first. Got to wait your turn, Miss Redheaded Girl. I can't do that. Come back. Come on, go. Let go. Look, usually she like tries to walk away. What looks tight? Oh yeah, you need to loosen that. Go walk on, Gabby says. You got it. Don't act nervous, remember? Yeah, remember, put your feet way far in front of you, Fiona said. Or did you just put them down one? Sophie lowered her stirrups. Because it's true, she has grown a ton. We're having another lesson in a couple of days and we're gonna get Stella going a little bit faster and get her going there's turn it yeah we're just yeah so we're gonna work her we're still gonna keep working on her we made some changes and we can tell that she's not all upset and she settled in and you know what I don't know I feel like whatever happened came and left I hope anyway um, Tex, <laughs> Tex is full of energy. She's scary riding, she said. Um, Tex got some big cuts on his neck, so he's trying to fit in the field, I think. Stella has for sure gained weight. Her girth is down a hole. She had went up like three holes, and now she's down a hole. So I think what I'm just going to do is just decide to let it go because it's almost winter here. The snow is coming and she's going to lose weight like crazy. And maybe just God knows what he's doing. And this little tiny bit of weight gain is um, in a bigger plan for her. So yeah, that happened. And I'm just going to just do what I can. Uh, Gabby and Kaylee are about to shoot a video. So we came outside. Storm's going to just eat grass as he's bitless. He's bitless, so he's good. Horses have so much energy today. Okay, Storm. Whoa. <laughs> Gabby feels like Storm has so much energy, he's gonna buck a little. All right, here we go. All right. <laughs> See, Texas spooking at the standard over there. So basically, it's just in the air. Come a little closer. Dance with you. Everything's 
Storm's just happy because he can see the grass. And Tex is taking a look at the standards to make sure they're not going to jump out and get him. And st <laughs> Storm! <laughs> get away from the edge. Her horse wants to gallop. Well, you know how to gallop. Go for it. He wants to gallop right back to the grass. A little girl said today, I want to see Storm buck on Gabby. And I said he does buck. That's, that's his thing. He does little tiny baby bucks. He never puts out that much energy. He just does a little tiny hop. <laughs> Get him away from the side! <laughs> Such a bad boy. Gabby, who's the who's the who's in charge of that horse? <laughs> Think she thinks he's gonna buck. Why? Because he has so much energy? Because he has so much energy? Yeah. Well, come on, let's see you canter him. He did it. He did it. She's cantering and there was no bucking. You just butted in front of Kaylee. I know, I didn't mean to. Then my horse wouldn't go. And then her horse wouldn't go. Must feel good to get out and get stretched out and see the grass and want to eat it. He has a one-track mind. Here we go. There we go. Can't wait till a day when I'm that com confident. I've been looking at you all night trying to figure you out. I just want to make you smile. Hold your hand in my hand looking at the sunset. Man, you're looking good tonight. I wanna kiss you before the sun goes down It's what you do making me feel like I'm falling And when you move Look at Storm's like so slow and lazy and, and Tex is just galloping along Holy crap Look at him go Suddenly Tex jumps the fence Oh my god <laughs> I know a lot of you guys ride that fast, but we're just still young. I'm going crazy for you. I feel like the ocean. You're not going. Storm's like, I'm out. <laughs> like, yeah, because he thinks he's going to eat the grass. Tex is like, let's fly. And Storm's like, let's eat. <laughs> I'm like, I'm ready to gallop. Let's go. Come on, guys. Come on. All right. Tell me when you guys are ready to start this video. Oh, I love it. He's like, oh, let's go play with Tex. Um, so Storm does have a sore pelvis. Um, only when, mostly only when I rode him, when I sat on him. It was noticeable. It wasn't a huge thing, but it was enough for me to get off. And anyway, so the chiropractor is coming in a couple of days. And so there's no jumping with Storm today. Or until he gets adjusted. Do you want this too? Because you've been looking at me all night trying to figure me out. I just want to let <laughs> okay, you're so glad what? Um, that Stella did not bolt. I mostly walked because she started to get like mad and like started to get antsy and stuff. So then I'm like, 
she's not like very happy that the other horse is left. And then she started to pull me and started to speed up and like, yeah. That's yeah, crazy. and that's normal for her, but then now that the bolt happened, she's paranoid. But, but yeah, there's a boy riding in the arena. First boy in any barn we've been to. So the girls are just acting foolish. Wow, this, this place is busy. All the horses are in. And it's nighttime. Mom, All the lights are on. An apple. This is when storms. I really want one because they're sour. I took a little bite. Mmm, yummy. I kind of miss doing chores. Do you miss doing chores, Sam? Whoa. He's starving. Yeah, he does not deserve any apples. The bucking. Well, he has to have one because it's good. Through the whole thing. Except for, the Except for the bucking and the grass Except eating. Except for the bucking and the grass eating. That's why we're gonna work on there with a bridle. All right, let's put him to bed. It's what you do. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.